Hello, this is Left Turn Productions, and since it's late at night and I don't really know what to do and I'm kind of bored, I figured I might as well do a round of the Hunger Games Simulator right here. Uh, so I've got uh, 33, no, 34 NASCAR drivers and uh, two other just kind of joke inclusions. I guess one of the NASCAR drivers is a joke inclusion, but like District 11, you've got uh, 33 NASCAR drivers in there, and District 12... But District 1 through 11, I mean, has 33 NASCAR drivers, 33 of the top drivers. District 12 has me, Natalie Decker. See, notice how I said that 1 through 11 of top drivers. Natalie Decker in District 12. And Drunken Brian France, you know that parody Twitter account that the actual Brian France is suing? Uh, yeah, he's in there as well. Uh, just because I thought it'd be fun. Uh, next time I do one of these, because I'm probably going to do another one, uh, I will include a different selection of people in district 12 well me and natalie will probably still be there but i'll probably have a third additional person in there in district 12 so yeah um we're just gonna go until somebody wins uh so let's proceed here so it's the bloodbath so this is the very beginning uh chase elliott already sets an explosive off and kills daniel suarez man daniel suarez cannot catch a break this year can he didn't qualify for the Daytona 500. Car died on him right at the start starting line. And now this. Uh, yeah. Martin Truex Jr. catches John Remachek off guard and kills him. So Truex already with a confirmed kill. Uh, Kevin Harvick stabs Ryan Blaney in the back with a trident. That is definitely a backstabber right there. Kevin Harvick already. Yeah. Uh, Corey LaJoy grabs a jar of fishing bait while Kyle Busch gets fishing, fishing gear. Uh, looks like they're going to be working together. A lot of people just running away. Denny Hamlin finds a bag full of explosives, so not just one explosive, just multiple. That's scary. <laughs> uh, Natalie Decker finds a bow, some arrows, and a quiver. Uh, all these guys run away. Uh, Christopher Bell stabs William Byron in the back with a trident, so that's another one down immediately. So I actually did run a test game beforehand, uh, and, uh, the rookies might have added, the four rookies in here, uh, Bell, Redick, Nemechek, and Custer were absolute animals. They were just insanely OP. Kyle Busch and Alex Bowman were really good, too. Uh, so we're going to see if that continues here. Um, Joy Logano thinks about home. Natalie Decker begging for Chase Elliott to kill her. Uh, but Chase Elliott decides not to. Uh, Christopher Bell and Martin Trex Jr. search for resources. Uh, Haley Dean and Denny Hamlin are talking in the distance. Ricky Stenhouse Jr. accidentally detonates a landmine while trying to arm it. I mean, Ricky Stenhouse Jr., he's just a walking disaster at this point. So I'm not really the least bit surprised. Uh, Kyle Larson stalks Chris, Chris Busher. Matt Benedetto sprains his ankle while running away from Kurt Busch. Drunken Brian France enters himself. I mean, <laughs> just look at that sentence out of context. <laughs> That's a great out of context sentence. Uh, I got to use that one for later. Uh, Clint Boyer steals from Kevin Harvick while he isn't looking. Now that's some backstabbing uh, on a teammate nonetheless. Corey LaJoy runs away from Ryan Newman. Oh, goodness gracious. Now, that's that's a very unfortunate coincidence right there because, you know, Corey LaJoy was the one that hit Ryan Newman in that really scary Daytona 500 crash that put Newman in the hospital. Uh, I'm sure Corey LaJoy, maybe he, like, saw Ryan Newman. And he's like, oh, no, not again. I don't want to, I don't want to, I don't want to hurt him again. And he just kind of runs away. That's, that's, that's what happens in my mind. That's what I feel like happened. Uh. I discovered a river, so uh, glad to see I'm making good use of my time. Raj Chassain sprains his ankle while running away from Kyle Bush, so people getting hurt running away from the Bush brothers. Uh, Brad Kozlowski got pricked by thorns while trying, well, while picking berries, and Bubble Wallace tries to spear fish with a trident. Okay. So here are your fallen soldiers here. Daniel Suarez right off the gate, pretty much. Uh, John Ernimacek, Ryan Blaney, William Byron, and Ricky Stenhouse Jr. Already some big names out like Blaney and Byron. So now we got the first night. Eric Jones stays awake, just can't sleep. 
Natalie Decker loses sight of where she is. Uh, Ryan Newman lets drunken Brian France into his shelter. <laughs> okay. Um, oh, no. Ryan Priest, Alex Bowman, Cole Custer, and Denny Hamlin form a suicide pact, killing themselves. Oh, no. That is very dark. Um, that's really unfortunate. Martin Trex Jr. fends Jimmy Johnson, Left Turn Productions, and Kyle Bush away from his fire. Come on, man. Come on. Uh, you're literally my favorite driver. Come on, you gotta let me in, man. I mean, I understand not letting in Kyle Bush and, I guess, Jimmy Johnson, but come on. I, I'm not gonna stab you in the back. Maybe. Tyler Reddick passes out from exhaustion. Uh, Joey Logano, Clint Boyer, and Chase Elliott get into a fight. Joey Logano triumphantly kills them both. So, Joey Logano kills both Boyer and... And Elliot, that's two more big names out on the first night. Anyway, Left Turn Productions practices his archery. I'm probably really bad at archery, by the way. Kurt Busch sets an explosive off, killing Kyle Larson of Ross Chastain. Oh my gosh. Backstabbing of the highest order. Kurt Busch killing his teammate and probably future teammate as well. Oh, man, Chip Ganassi's not going to be happy about that. <laughs> Haley Deegan stalks Christopher Bell. Um, okay, Matt Benedetto hurts himself. Jimmy, Lo Jimmy Johnson severely injures Joey Logano but puts him out of his misery. So Logano is out after he got both Elliott and Boyer. And Johnson gets Logano here. I know someone who will be really happy about that. And that is, uh, I, I'm pretty sure... Uh, Boss Motion Racing Network's going to be really happy about that outcome. Uh, yeah, some more of this. Chris Buescher has an explosive. That's scary. Nine cannon shots, so nine ones down. Ryan, P Ryan Priest, Alex Bowman, Cole Custer, Denny Hamlin, Clint Boyer, Chase Elliott, Kyle Larson, Ross Chastain, and Joey Logano. I think that's everyone from District 1, except... Oh, wait, I think Kurt Busch was in there. Uh, anyway... We're at the second night now. Haley Deegan convinces Eric Jones to snuggle with her. <laughs> That's funny. Um, okay. Uh, Chris Buescher can't start a fire. Kurt Busch severely injures Eric Almirola but puts him out of his misery. Kurt Busch is a madman. He's already got, I think, three kills, maybe four. He's on a roll. Christopher Bell consists of Michael McDowell to snuggle with him. Okay. Uh, Ryan Newman and Brad Kozlowski have a truce. Martin Trix Jr. defeats Tyler Reddick in a fight but spares his life. Drunken Brian France defeats Kevin Harvick in a fight but spares his life. So Drunken, Fry Drunken Brian France has somehow managed to beat Kevin Harvick in a fight. That's funny. Uh, and Okay. Uh, Corey LaJoy, me, and the Dylan brothers telling each other ghost stories to lighten the mood. Day three, Matt Benedetto hunts for other tributes. Drunken Brian France gets some fresh food. Okay. Ryan Newman sits an explosive off, killing off Chris Buescher, Brad Keselowski, and Kurt Busch. So he just killed any chance of uh, a Chip Ganassi driver winning. Uh, and he got his own teammate, too. Man, teammates backstabbing each other seems to be the theme for this round, it seems like. Uh, but not these teammates here. Kyle Busch and Eric Jones hunting for other tributes. Uh, I'm going hunting. Okay. Tyler Reddick, Ty Dillon, Bubba Wallace, and Kevin Harvick raid Christopher Bell's camp while he's hunting. That's unfortunate. Uh, and yeah, okay. So going on here, Almarola, Busher, Kozlowski, and Kurt Busch are down. Now it's the third night. Um, Martin Trix Jr. and Left Turn Productions fight Bubba Wallace and Kevin Harvick. Bubba Wallace and Kevin Harvick survive. Me and Truex go down together. Oh, man, how fitting. Both me and Truex go down doing the same thing, fighting Bubba Wallace and Kevin Harvick. We just, we just couldn't fight him off. Uh, I'm going to assume the, uh, Kevin Harvick beat Truex and, and Bubba Wallace beat me because that seems like the best scenario. I don't know. Best scenario, what I mean. I'm, what am I even talking about? Uh, Kyle Busch convinces Corey LaJoy to snuggle with him. That's weird. Uh, 
Drunken Brian France begs for Michael McDowell to kill him. He refuses keeping Drunken Brian France alive. Okay. Drunken Brian France is still in this. Anyway, let's get going. Ryan Newman and Eric Jones fight the Dillon Brothers. And Ryan Newman and Eric Jones get both Dillon Brothers. Oh, man. <laughs> Newman and Jones beating up the Dillons. Just completely just ending any of their chances of winning. Uh, I mean, yeah, that, that's that's just what happened. Corey LaJoy silently snaps Kevin Harvick's neck. Oh, man. Drunken Brian France fishes. He's not going to be catching much fish. He's drunk. Uh, Jimmy Johnson hurt himself. Matt Benedetto stabs Bubble Walls with a tree branch. Haley Deegan defeats Tyler Reddick in a fight, but spares his life. Haley Deegan's tough. She could probably beat anybody in a fight. Truex, me, Ty Dillon, Austin Dillon, Kevin Harvick, Bubba Wallace, all out now. All dead. Night four. Natalie Decker and Matt Benedetto tell stories about themselves to each other. I'm sure they've got some very interesting tales to tell. Uh, Jimmy Johnson screams for help. <laughs> uh, is, are any of his teammates left? Because I know Elliot's gone. Uh, no, it's just him. He doesn't have any teammates left, so... Yeah, he's not getting any help, unfortunately. In fact, he might... No, Tyler Reddick's still in it. Uh, I was about to say he might be the only Chevy driver left, but uh, it's just him and Reddick. Uh, Corey LaJoy convinces Ryan Newman to snuggle him. Okay, so uh, he went from running away from Newman out of fear and possibly PTSD to now wanting Ryan Newman to snuggle with him. Okay, that makes sense. Drunken Brian France thinks about home. Anyway, The Feast... The cornucopia is replenished with food, supplies, weapons, and memoirs. Uh, oh, we've got a fight. Christopher Bell and Eric Jones fight Kyle Busch and Jimmy Johnson. Christopher Bell and Eric Jones survive. The worst case scenario for Boss Motion Racing Network as his two favorite drivers fall to Christopher Bell and Eric Jones. Man, that's unfortunate. Uh, Brian, <laughs> drunk... <laughs> Drunken Brian Brand steals Matt Benedetto's memoirs. Why would you do that? I mean, he is drunk in Brian France, but come on. Michael McDowell severely slices Ryan Newman with a sword. That's okay. Um, okay. Uh, Tyler Reddick and Haley D get into a fight over raw meat, but Tyler Reddick gives up and runs away. I would, uh, not, or Haley Deegan would have probably killed you. Corey LaJoy doesn't go. Natalie Decker doesn't go. Uh, almost everybody went, actually. That's pretty rare. Day five. Let's see who we've got left here. Christopher Bell, Eric Jones, Drunken Brian France, Michael McDowell, Natalie Decker, Tyler Reddick, Corey LaJoy, Matt Benedetto, and Haley Deegan are still in this. And uh, nobody dies here. Uh, Kyle Busch, Jimmy Johnson, Ryan Newman all out after the fifth day. Haley Deegan receives an explosive from an unknown sponsor. Matt Benedetto gets medical supplies. Christopher Bell throws a knife in Eric Jones' head. So after working together to kill Jimmy Johnson and Kyle Busch, Christopher Bell stabs Eric Jones in the back, or rather the head, I guess. Oh, man. Christopher Bell not making any friends here. Oh, man. Day six. Natalie Decker steals from Christopher Bell while he isn't looking. Everybody's been stealing from Christopher Bell, it seems like. But Christopher Bell's still on a killing spree, it seems like. Haley Deegan practices her archery. Uh, Michael McDowell injures himself, so it looks like there's eight drivers plus drunken Brian France left. Rather, seven drivers plus drunken Brian France. Eric Jones, the only cannon shot here. Now we're in the sixth night. Tyler Reddick decapitates Haley Deegan with a sword. Oh, man. Well, Haley Deegan's out. Uh-oh. Oh, we got something big here. Drunken Brian France, Christopher Bell, and Corey LaJoy successfully ambush and kill Michael McDowell, Matt Benedetto, and Natalie Decker. So a bloody night. Goodness gracious. Christopher Bell, Corey LaJoy, Tyler Reddick, and Drunken Brian France are the only ones left. Oh, man, I'm kind of pulling for Drunken Brian France here. <laughs> Christopher Bell, Corey Joy, yeah. So nothing really happens here. And the field has been halved. 
Uh, Haley Deegan, Michael McDowell, Matt Benedetto, and Natalie Decker all out. Drunken Brian France destroys Christopher Bell's supplies while he's asleep. Poor Christopher Bell. He has just been picked on this entire time. Uh, I mean, I guess that's actually a good strategy because Bell has been also a monster in this game. So, Corey Joy defeats Tyler Reddick in a fight but spares his life. So now we got day seven. Tyler Reddick poisons Christopher Bell's drink again. People trying to screw over Christopher Bell. But unfortunately, Tyler Reddick mistakes it for his own and perishes. Corey LaJoy has an explosive. Drunken Brian France falls into a pit and dies. I mean, uh, if you're intoxicated, uh, you know, sometimes you just make the wrong step. And uh, you just fall right into that pit. So Drunken Brian France is out. Tyler Reddick is out. So it's just Christopher Bell and Corey LaJoy left. Who will survive? This will probably be it right here. As soon as I tap this screen, we will probably see who wins. Corey LaJoy taints Christopher Bell's food, killing him. Corey LaJoy wins from District 10. And Corey LaJoy has defeated everybody else. Let's proceed to the records here. Five kills. Christopher Bell. Okay. I understand why everyone was ganging up on Christopher Bell. Look at how many kills he had. Seven kills. Drunken Brian France managed to kill three people. Uh, Corey LaJoy with five. He won there. Tyler Reddick with one kill. Matt Benedetto with one kill. Ryan Newman with five kills. Goodness gracious. Michael McDowell with one. Eric Jones with four. Jimmy Johnson with one. Martin Tricks Jr. with one. Kevin Harvick with three. Bubba Wallace with two. Kurt Busch with three. Joey Logano with two. And uh, Chase Elliott with one, it appears. So I believe that's going to do it. This is just the summary, it looks like. You can just see, uh, there were no events, it looks like. No arena events, so. That was kind of odd. I guess that doesn't happen every time. And yeah, here are the final results, it looks like. So, uh, go and find where your favorite driver ended up. Or, you know, just find where Drunken Brian France ended up. Third place. Um... But yeah, thank you guys for watching this. Uh, if enough people like this, maybe I'll make more. Uh, and uh, I think it's pretty enjoyable and it's pretty funny sometimes. Just some of the coincidences that you can get from this. Uh, so yeah, thank you guys for watching. This is Left Turn Productions, signing out.